Alright, welcome back everybody, Bree guys, a new YouTube video today. So today we're going to be talking about a little deep detail about what we saw in the Halo Infinite trailer and stuff like that so so we can be seen. So uh, the vehicles that we saw is a Gun Goose, a Mongoose, a Warhog. We have a Razorback, which is you can store stuff in the back of it, and we got a Rocket Hog. We got a Banished Wraith, a Banished Banshee, a Banished Ghost, a Banished Chopper, and a Wasp, a Scorpion Tank, a Pelican, and we have new equipment pickups. So we have a Grappling Hook, which you can like grapple stuff, and we got a Repulsor, we got a Camouflage, a Shield Wall, an Overshield, and new weapons, which is a... Some kind of the, the physic, uh, I forgot what the name was, some, the pistol rework. I'll put this screenshot here on the screen in the gameplay so you guys can see the little pistol. It's not a rework, but it's like a little little uh, quality rework, stuff like that. We have the, the weapons that we saw was that AR, the BR, the Bulldog, the Commando Sniper. We have the Spiker Rocket Launcher. We have the Skur, which is another rocket launcher. We have uh, uh, the Needler, the Pulse Carbine. We have uh, the ricochet weapon. I don't know what that could be. It can like, I don't know what that's gonna do. Like, it bounces off the walls or something. I don't know what the hell that's gonna do. The gravity hammer, the plasma pistol, the engineer sword, and the new game modes we have is uh, CTF, King of the Hill, FFA, Oddball, Warzone Control, VTB, which is pretty cool. And we have dynamic vehicle destruct destruction, which means. We're gonna see like like wheels popping off, blowing up off of vehicles and stuff like that. So it's gonna be more detailed in vehicles when they get destroyed or parts when they get absolutely obliterated. So the battle passes that you earn will also will always be there. So if you buy a battle pass and you go back and get it, the battle passes will always be there. So once you like buy a pop a battle pass and the time limit runs out, you're not gonna be able to like get it if you're playing other games. But now when you're playing Halo Infinite, you can go back to any battle pass and buy it and earn all the, am the armor you wanted so uh, which is pretty cool so uh there is a new graphic comparison when the game got delayed the graphics look really really amazing right now so it's crazy so i'll probably pull up on screen here like the the comparison of the halo Infinite graphics back in 2020 or back in 2021 of this year and uh the halo Infinite, um, we don't have a release date yet but the only thing we have you know that's coming is holiday 2021 and there's gonna be a beta coming this summer I think in July, I'm not sure, and then we have free to play multiplayer, which was announced in the trailer at E3, and we have a lot of vehicle customization and armor and weapons you, you can customize, which is which, which is really pretty cool, so I'll go in deep in depth of what this can look, what this will look like in this gameplay right here, you guys are looking at right now, so you can, like, you can, like, upgrade the, the chest armor, your, your helmet, your visor, you can uh, upgrade your... Your, your gun coding, it's, it's crazy. So uh, the trailer and the campaign trailer are up on the Halo Halo YouTube channel, so you can again look at that in the link in the description of this video. So the armor presentation, chest armor, core armor, coding gloves, assault rifle coding, visitor helmets, modify your own AI in game, in game to how they sound and personally, person personality. So that's, which is pretty cool. So you can like customize your own AI which goes back in your helmet and you can like so Academy is a customize how he sounds and uh, how his personality is kind of on board into the experience it's great for pretty cool newer players who are and there's pelican drops which drops and stuff and you can grapple into vehicles um, there's also a new training area which you can train train your aim there's a course the um, you can reverse bots and uh, you can change the difficulty training mode that you can so uh, use to which is pretty cool and Halo Infinite will support split screen and Halo Infinite beta in the summer which is obviously pretty awesome so uh, sorry if I like went through all this information really fast I just want to go through it, all the important stuff that we saw in the trailer and stuff like that so I'll try to put as much gameplay in the background as I can so uh, uh what, which I can't really wait for is the, the, the detailed and these armors you can customize and free to play multiplayer is going to be crazy you're going to pay for the battle pass and stuff like that and I feel like you customizing customizing the armor the way you want and it's customizing you thought Halo 5 has good customization wait till we play Halo Infinite it's going to be crazy which is I cannot wait to play Halo Infinite um, which is going to be crazy um campaign is hopefully it's good um free to play multiplayer is really gonna spice things up if you're a halo fan and it's really gonna it's gonna for 
not force people, but it's gonna bring attention to this game to people to play this free-to-play Halo multiplayer game, which is actually pretty crazy. So uh, if you guys want to see, like, if you slow motion the trailer, you can see stuff that you couldn't see. Um, there's a lot of abilities and grappling hook and stuff like that. Um, there's a, a shield and stuff like that. There's a lot of equipment that you can use in multiplayer, which is going to be crazy. You can pick weapons off the walls and stuff like that. It's just the same as a uh, Halo 5 and it's gravity hammer. We got the engine sword. It's just, it's, the trailer was pretty cinematic, and I really, really loved it. So uh, yeah, the, I cannot. I want to. I want to use that samurai samurai outfit so bad. If that's in the battle pass, I'm definitely gonna unlock that. And hopefully, you can cut my like the colors on it. It'd be pretty cool. Have like a blue, blue samurai. That'd be badass as hell. So I hope you guys really enjoy this video. I wanted to talk about more about Halo Infinite and go over the basic stuff and like the games and give us my honest opinion. I think my opinion. The graphics look, the graphics look really good. I really don't care about the graphics that much because if you're a Halo fan, you really don't care about graphics that much. And seeing like when the reboot trailer was at back in E3, like through like 2018, 2019, 20, 2020, and 2021, you'll see like like a graphic comparison. So I really don't care about the graphics. I cannot wait to play this game. Hopefully, this game is really good as the trailer looks, and I cannot wait to play it. So hope you guys really enjoy this, like and subscribe, and uh, I will put pictures on screen here so you guys can see all the images of this game from the trailer and stuff like that. So hope you guys really enjoy this, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace out. Play it day one with Xbox Game Pass.